In this Camtasia tutorial, I'll show you how to place a video inside text. This is simply a video in text effect. So you've probably seen this all over the internet. Uh, but until recently, it was not possible to do this in Camtasia. But I'm going to show you step by step how you can add a video in text. And it's pretty simple and easy to do. So let's begin by adding our video. Let's just drag and drop it to the media bin and then we can just drop it to our timeline. So there is our video, uh, a rectangular video, uh, but we need this uh, it to be inside a text or maybe some text of sorts. Let's say you're working on a vacation video uh, or something else uh, that will potentially act as a transition or an intro. So uh, this effect works well if you're doing intros uh, for your particular projects that you're working on. So there we have our video. The next thing we need to do, we need to go to the annotations tab and we need to add a text callout. So we'll just drag and drop the text callout and then move it to the end of our clip or where we need it to get to. So let's say it's up to the end. So once we're satisfied with that, just come in and change the text and add a title that you feel works for you. For the purposes of this video, I'll just type in intro with caps uh, enabled. So this is a small font. And for us to work well with this, we need a bolder font. And the simplest font of all is Arial Black. So we can just uh, control A and then select Arial Black. And once we do that, uh, we can also try and adjust the size. And uh, by default, it gets to 256. But the maximum uh, font size that you can get is about 500 and we can just input in that manually and uh, let's see if we can do anything else let's say bold it's already bold uh, so there's nothing else we can do there but now we have our text on top of our video now we want our video inside our text so what do we need to do we'll need to go back to the track mat options right here uh, next to the eye right click on it and then just do the alpha uh, alpha track and there we have it so you can see me behind a video there we go there we go there we go so uh, potentially the applications for this is to create intros you can also use this uh, maybe uh, as a transition to show what's coming up next for uh, maybe the video inside text to show what's coming up next it's a pretty slick feature add a couple of sound effects and uh, this will be uh, an awesome feature so let's try and uh, see if we can do something else let's say we want to add a behavior to this we can just uh, let's say we do a pop-up just drag and drop it there and if we play our video welcome to my youtube channel so it looks good i think it's something good and as always, remember, if uh, you just need this on this particular uh, clip, then always remember to group your clips. Just control G or just uh, right click and uh, control and always disable uh, the track mat for this track too. So right click on it and then just uh, click on none so that uh, you'll see even if you added other content on top, you'll see or you'll have uh, this media available and not the black thing that we were seeing. So this is a good thing. Uh, the Camtasia has decided to add. The track mats have unlimited functions that once you keep practicing, you'll get to note things that you can incorporate in your video editing and in your Camtasia editing so that you can spice up your videos and create emphasis in your videos. If you like this video, kindly hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, share it with your friends so that we can all learn together. Thank you for watching this video and until next time, never stop learning. Thank you for watching.